This Raw Vision video is brought to you by Metro Solar, proud partner of the Richmond Football Club. Yeah, I think Connor was, you know, he got a couple of games last year and I remember a big long goal against Port Adelaide. Cut to that. Second game of AFL footy, looking for his first goal in the big time. And it's a big time kick. <laughs> and they've come for the young man. Yeah, he showed that he can play, but uh, it was probably inconsistent and spasmodic. And I've seen him uh, mature over the um, pre-season. He's become much more responsible and professional with his um, preparation and out on the track, you know, you see him a lot more getting the ball. I think he understands the game, he, uh, he actually shares the game plan with the other younger players and uh, helps them out. And all of those attributes will uh, lead him to get more of the ball and he's great, great chase down, great uh, running ability both long distance and, uh, and sprinting, so uh, with him opening up the play, it's all good for our forwards and uh, pulls the opposition out of, out of play and at the same time when they've got the ball he can chase them down and tackle, which um, is vital in his role. Look, he needs to both work inside and outside, so we've been working on uh, getting contested ball and that's um, important for all young players. I think uh, understanding exactly how the, um, the wing role works and, uh, you know, Camden McIntosh at this time last year was probably similar and we gave him opportunity and really flourished so he's going to have to uh, force someone out of the side. It's not like he's just walk up start but if someone got injured or well, he's, he's a fair chance to play straight up. You know, he's got great attributes and you know we're going to be a fast side and we're going to keep looking to play faster players in our, in our team. 